Well, Sharice and Mike, Walker's Point has been the Bush's, uh, Bush family's second home for almost a century, if you can imagine. Uh, this is where President Bush spent many of his summers. Tonight, Walker's Point sits dark and quiet with just a light shining on the American flag, which now sits and half staff. Now, locals and tourists are not only mourning the loss of a president, but a loss of their neighbor and friend George. The president and his wife, First Lady Barbara Bush, were a big part of this community. Their home on Walker's Point really put Kenny Bunk put on the global map by hosting presidents and prime ministers from around the world. But the Bushes also opened their hearts to this community. They were constantly giving back here and in other parts of Maine. People we spoke with say the president's passing has created a large void. It's very sad. I think he was a very lovely man. And I think he was a good president. And, and very think, smart. And a very smart, caring man. Yeah. And I think it's just, you know, it's always sad when a president passes away. <clears throat> Now, it's hard to believe it was just a couple of months ago when people came out here to Walker's Point to pay their respects following the death of First Lady Barbara Bush. Many people we spoke with say next summer will be especially hard without their neighbors, Barbara and George. Reporting live here in Kennebunkport, I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.